Hi guys, Katie here. Um, I'm doing an unboxing for the last two dolls in the So Sleepy line of Lala Loopsy Mini. Um, there are, it says there's eight in the series, but only four of them are So Sleepies. Um, the other four are a different type. I already have uh, Peppy and Crumbs. Each each of these guys come with a sleeping bag and a pet. Um, I already started unboxing Peanut and then I, I hit the record button so it stopped my recording. Um, I'm actually at an airport and I am not able to open them as carefully as usual. I don't think I ruined Peanut's box, um, but I did ruin the other one a little bit. So this is Peanut's box. It does become a bedroom. Peanut Big Top. Her sleeping bag is a red and white stripe. It kind of looks like a popcorn package. It has an orange zipper detail and pink inside with orange dots. She comes with her elephant friend. The elephant's purple with black button eyes, a red heart, and a red hat. And then here's Peanut, purple hair, rosy pink, uh, light pink cheeks, a pink star, black button eyes, um, red bows, a uh, yellowy orange um, pajama set with an orange zipper and pink polka dots. And she also has a little bum flap. So that's Peanut. And we'll put her with our other three girls. And then the last one in the set is Pixie Flutters. Pixie was the last one for me to buy simply because um, she's not in the same style pajamas as the other girls. The other girls are in like one onesies um, where she's in like a bathrobe. So I did damage the back of her packaging, um, but it is supposed to be her bedroom. Pixie flutters. And then, just like usual, we have our packaging. First thing I do is I pop out the sleeping bag. The inside is a white and a green stripe. It's got a pink sleeping bag with light pink polka dots, yellow zipper detail, a red heart, a blue button, and a yellow button. Um, and this is called, if this was actual string, it's called Rick Rack, um, but it's just a painted on detail. So it's not actually Rick Rack, but it is a Rick Rack detailing. And then the back is usually plain. She comes with a little bumblebee kind of thing, pink wings and black button eyes, and the, the pet is yellow, and then finally a doll, Pixie Flutters. She has lime green hair, white flowers with yellow um, in the middle. She has a darker skin tone than the other girls with um, cute little freckles, black button eyes, like pink cheeks. Uh, her outfit is like a light bluish teal color. It looks like a bathrobe with a uh, pink detailing and then pink um, boot slippers. So. Here's our two new girls, and here's our two previous. Um, because I'm on vacation and I bought these for vacation, I did leave their pets at home. I just didn't want to lose them, but I did bring their sleeping bag and the doll, and then we opened our two new ones. So here we have Pixie, or Pixie. Peanut, Peppy, and Crumbs. 
And these are the four dolls in the So Sleepy Minis line. Um, the only thing I would say about these versus the other mini Lala Loopsies is that they come with less accessories for the same price. Um, you are getting a nice little fabric sleeping bag, which is very cute. But the other dolls tend to come with a pet. Um, like Marina Anchors, for example, comes with two pets a fishing pole, um, a snow cone, so there's there's all these little details that go with them. Um, I kind of like that what you're getting is, even though it's just a little sack, it's essentially a piece of furniture rather than just extra decorations, so that's always nice. Um, but you are getting less plastic um, toy-wise in these packs than you are um, the other packs. So for the price, um, it might not be the set to go with for you, but it's all about what you prefer in your toys. I'm very happy with the So Sleepy line. It took me a while to pick them up, um, but now that I have them all, I, I certainly don't regret getting them. So that was my quick unboxing. Um, I mean, there's not much to review about these guys. They're just fun. Um, they're not very breakable. Um, you know, they're, they're, they're fairly durable. They're easy to pose. There's not a lot of posing, but they are easy to pose. And they're just cute. So, um, if you find them cute and you're, you're willing to pay the, the, you know, average cost for, um, a smaller doll like this, then it's definitely something I would say is worth it. These guys are probably about number 20 for me. Um, as far as the mini goes, and I do have a littles and a full size, so it's become a bit of an addiction. But anyway, Pixie, Peanut, Peppy, and Crumbs. Thanks for watching.